Hey there folks, it is Wednesday, January the 1st of 2014. Happy New Year and welcome to 7 Minutes in the Morning. Yep, that's right, it is New Year's Day of 2014 and this is 7 Minutes in the Morning, your daily dose from me, your business coach. I hope uh, that you had a, uh, a good uh, celebration of the New Year's Eve last night and I thank you for joining me uh, to, to launch your new year uh, with this episode. So uh, this week, we're going to continue what we've been looking at this week. Some uh, Monday, we took a look back at the year that was. Um, then Tuesday, and for the rest of the week, we're going to be looking forward till Friday when we get to uh, my predictions episode, uh, where we'll talk about the things that you need to be looking out for uh, as you get your small business going in 2014. So um, we're going to jump right in today. Today we're talking about video. I think one of the things that will be prominent in 2014 is the use of video by small business for lots of different things. But before we get into those, I want to talk just a minute about some stats that you might find interesting from YouTube. Um, every day, every month, there are one billion unique users that visit YouTube. Every month, a billion with a B, unique users. You probably can find a couple of customers in that bunch. Nielsen, the folks that do the TV ratings, they said that YouTube reaches more 18 to 34 year olds than any of the cable networks. Mobile, uh, or people watching on a mobile device, an iPad, an iPhone, uh, Android, a Kindle, that sort of thing, mobile devices make up more than 40% of the watch time on YouTube. Uh, YouTube uh, accounts for greater than 28 percent of all the searches that occur on Google search engine. So more than a quarter of the searches that are being done on Google are happening through YouTube. And finally over 500 years of YouTube video is watched every day every day on Facebook. 500 years worth of video is watched through Facebook every day. So definitely those are some stats that should convince you that there's this, this strong interest in video uh, through uh, or, or in the, the person of our consumer market. So, you know, we go back to the idea that you should fish where the fish are. You market where your market spends their time, right? Clearly, they're spending their time watching video. So you need to do video as part of your um, marketing arsenal. So just to prove my point, uh, and to, um, as the saying goes here, eat my own dog food, uh, today's episode of 7 Minutes in the Morning is being recorded on video. I'm going to post it on YouTube, uh, and you'll be able to watch it on uh, the Facebook page uh, and on the 7minutesinthemorning.com webpage. Now, here are a couple of things, and I'm going to point one out, right? I don't have a perfect setup, I don't have a great camera, in fact I'm using my iPad to record the video. There's lots of ways to record better video, but this one gets the job done. Tip number one, you don't have to make it perfect, right? You're not making, uh, you're not competing with J.J. Uh, Abrams or any of the guys that make great movies. You are putting together valuable content for your audience, right? It only has to be viewable. <laughs> and meaningful, right? It doesn't have to be perfect. So don't go out and buy thousands of dollars worth of equipment. Don't go out and hire a video crew to come in and do the video. Maybe you want to do something better than your iPhone, right? I mean, you can check out this video on the website, see how you like it, right? But maybe this is good enough for what you want to do. It's definitely good enough for the first one. Do the first one, get it posted, and get started, right? Don't be intimidated by the process. Don't feel like you have to make it perfect. Second, you want to become kind of the go-to uh, source in your niche. Now, I've said before, probably many times before, that I have a, an older vehicle. It's a Jeep Cherokee. I love my Jeep. You can ask my wife. Um, she'll tell you any day of the week. <laughs> I love that truck. Lots of things that need to be worked on, and the first place I go, most of the time, when I'm looking for a how-to on how to fix something on the truck, is on YouTube, right? Now, and, and there are a lot of car manufacturers, a lot of 
especially second uh, or aftermarket part manufacturers that have really picked up on this. A lot of great videos on how to take their products, install them in the vehicle, uh, do maintenance and upgrades to the vehicle. Even if it's not a product that you sell, right? You, they, we'll extend this Jeep analogy for a little bit. Let's say, you know, I sell tires, right? But uh, most of my customers have Jeeps, so I'm going to talk about some of the topics that are important to them, right? Remember, fish where the fish are. Finally, and I already touched on this, be sure to add value. If your video adds value, that makes up for a lot of the production um, less than perfection <laughs> moments, right? Add value and people will come and watch your video. So, uh, my challenge to you is to, uh, before this week is up, get a video shot. It doesn't have to be long, four or five minutes, not even that, 30 seconds. Do a 30 second commercial. Script it out like you would read it on TV and make a commercial for your business. Put it up online. Share the link with us here in the 7 Minutes community. I'd love to see some of those and I'll share those around. Uh, you can do that, 7minutesinthemorning.com or you can go to the Facebook page. Uh, that's facebook.com slash Tom Rigsby Coaching. Love to hear, um, see those videos, not hear them, see those videos and share those around with the community. Well, I hope that's helped you out a little bit. I hope you have a great 2014, have a great uh, rest of January the 1st. And I will be back with you tomorrow when we will continue looking at the year that is to come. Until then, my name is Tom Rigsby and I am your business coach.